Hey Collective, how's everyone doing today? We're doing good. Say hi guys. Say hi Collective. <laughs> She's sleepy, <laughs> of course, always. Hope everyone's having a good day. We're having a good day. I'm excited. I got a new deck. What do I do with it? I got a new deck today, so I got this deck today. It just got here, so <laughs> I've been playing with it and seeing how it how it flows, and I'm enjoying this. So we're gonna play with this deck today and see what comes out. <laughs> All right, collectors. So I hope that you'll please like and share and subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos whenever I upload. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your time that you spend with me. Thank you for your donations and for booking your personal readings and healing work. I love you guys so much. Thank you, collective. All right, guys. Let's tap in. Let's see what's going on. What do we need to know, Spirit? What would you like us to know about? I've been tapping into a murder all morning, so I'm just telling you. The killer may currently be in prison for another crime. I just heard gang related in my head. There's a friend that knows something. This killer has already been interviewed. Victim engaged in unusual behavior prior to the crime. Someone could have met at a cemetery. Masks are definitely pertinent. Killer profile indicates nar a narcissist or sociopath. And he's got a huge devil behind him, which is his shadow. This person's possessed by the fucking devil. Additional evidence at the scene may be discovered. Could be near where the body was found. Take a closer look at one of the suspects. You may need to bring in the lineup again. The witness may not be fully disclosing all of the facts here. Yeah. Somebody's not saying something. A friend knows something. Take a closer look at one of the suspects, which could be a friend of this person. This person's already been interviewed. Victim engaged in unusual behavior prior to this crime, and this friend knows this. They may have witnessed this happening, could have confided in this friend. And this friend who could definitely be this witness here, it's not telling the facts. They don't. I'm hearing they're scared and they don't want to get involved, but they're going to have to. Dating history or killer knew of the victim. So, this person either dated this person or knew of them and it wasn't just a random thing. Important details are not being revealed to the public at this time. This killer sustained a wound during the murder. And this killer will murder again. Forensic science will provide important details and clues regarding this investigation and money has been involved. So this killer could have already done something and committed other crimes. I'm hearing like a serial killer friend knows something and money may be involved. The friend was paid to stay quiet. It's a killer that's already been interviewed. They're out of the area right now. So they could be traveling away from their current you know, like location that they actually live in. Or they travel out of the area that they live in to commit crimes victim engaged in unusual behavior prior to the crime. We've got the killer worked in the area. So they could hmm, 
could have been stalking this person at their job. Could have told someone that they felt uncomfortable like they were being followed. This killer profile indicates narcissist or sociopath. Interviews with relatives or friends may provide valuable clues. So to help understand the behavioral patterns and habits of this person, to talk to family or friends. Additional evidence at the scene may be discovered. We got someone coerced the killer into murdering the victim. Take a closer look at one of the suspects. You may need to do DNA testing. Someone else that was at the scene, their DNA evidence was left behind and they coerced this person into helping with this, with this crime. Because forensics is out here twice. DNA testing and it, this crime may be solved by DNA testing or other scientific methods. Under a witness may not be fully disclosing all of the facts. We have jealousy, an affair, or a love-related crime. So it's like a crime of passion I'm hearing. The dating history or killer of... Wait. The dating history or killer knew of the victim. We have the suspect lives near the scene of the crime. Important details are not being re revealed to the public at this time. This. Details leading up to the murder may be worth investigating. So things that led up to this, it's not being released to the public because they're still investigating. Killer sustained a wound during the murder. Killer sustained a wound during the murder. Spirit, clarify this. Nothing's coming out. Let me show you. I know about this wound. Additional evidence is at the crime scene. So whatever this wound was, it left additional evidence at the crime scene could have been blood that was left behind the perpetrator oh the killer will murder again and we have the perpetrator has behavioral patterns of a serial killer it's exactly what I've been tapping into this morning I mean like all morning I've been sitting here for the past two or three hours reading cards of a spirit killer had an agree or had an argument or disagreement with the victim before they died. Cell phone records may provide important clues here. There was a motive for committing this crime and many was involved. Spontaneous behavior or mental illness contributed to the crime. There's a key piece of evidence that's going to help solve this crime and forensics is going to have to be involved with this. What do I need now? I'm drawing here. Killer may currently be in prison for another crime. Forensic science field will provide important clues. We got tired of drama. So there's some kind of crazy drama that's playing out with this. Tell me more. The situation's about to explode. Shit's about to pop off in flames. This person's a hater. Bad. Really bad. A friend knows something. Money may be involved. Tell me about this. It's a bugaboo friend. 
this person definitely is deceitful. They're a backstabber, they're a traitor, and they're not to be trusted. This is a major betrayal. This friend is a hater here. I'm tired of the drama with this person. Well, the situation's about to pop off because the record's about to be set straight. The police are here, and we've got the trash can. So they could have uh, tried to get rid of some kind of evidence or throw something away here. It could have been someone that... Just went through a divorce or a breakup. Hmm. Already interviewed the killer. The killer is out of the area. Total drama. Action. Could be out. Huh. Recording something somewhere. Trying to discard, trying to discard some kind of video footage. Got investigating here. So the investigator knows that this person is out of the area. They've already interviewed this person. They're still tailing this person. They're still on to them. Victim engaged in unusual behavior prior to the crime. The killer worked in the area. We got bank failure. So this person could have worked in a bank or something. We've got running away. So some of this investigation here also includes a bank. And a factory is on this card right here. This could be like some kind of a factory. Killer profile indicates narcissist or sociopath. Interviews with relatives or friends may provide valuable clues. This person's been getting played with manipulation, lies, and control. How this this the mo of this narcissist or sociopath here they play people manipulate they lie constantly because they want to have all of the control over the victim interviews with relatives or friends may provide valuable clues of how they are in relationships just how they are interacting with people period can definitely provide huge clues as when you're trying to profile someone this is someone that definitely would be an ex here that threw away the person like trash. Family could know about something being thrown away after this breakup. They already know the tea and somebody's getting ready to set the record straight because of getting kicked to the curb here. Once this breakup happened, this person could have started doing drugs. And it started changing their behavior and escalating these narcissistic and sociopathic, psychopathic tendencies if we've got a serial killer too. I mean, this person's out of control. We've got fake friends here, so just a hater acting like they're your friend, but they're not. Additional evidence at the scene may be discovered. Someone coerced the killer into murdering the victim. Doing drugs and kick to the curb came out. So, this person could be an ex. And whoever they were hanging out with doing drugs coerced someone into helping with this, into getting rid of evidence here. There could have been a burning of evidence. Could have, I'm seeing a car on fire. Could have made a, a video of this on their phone. A video of the crime could be on their phone. Oh my God, pitting on a show just flew out, yeah. And it's right beside doing drugs. Maybe they were recording this person 
after they had drugged them. This crime could have been definitely recorded here. It's like a sick, twisted way for this person to go back and relive it over and over again. Because they like to do that and they like to revisit the crime scene. Take a closer look at one of the suspects. This crime may be solved by DNA testing or other scientific methods. So, tantric sex here, so... It could even be like a rape kit. This person's life's falling apart and they're falling into pieces. Fighting for what you love. Claiming what is yours. Love is a battlefield. There's a copycat here, so this could be someone that they broke up from and this person got jealous and they ended up creating this crime of passion here they could have followed this person they could have gotten a room or been sleeping around with somebody and it ended up being game over for this person the witness may not be fully disclosing all of the facts jealousy and affair or love related crime yep yeah they got caught making bad choices they got caught cheating and it created this crime of passion here finding evidence getting caught and cheating for these bad choices we've got envy this person was so jealous oh my god they're so pissed off because they were supposed to be in this committed partnership here with this person and they caught them cheating and they know that they're not authentic in their apology and this person knows that they fucked up. They're in toxic private relationships out running around being promiscuous. And it's got this person crazy. This person needs to check themselves and use caution. Because this recording here, but you can see it looks like it tried to be burned here. Burning evidence. We've got pregnancy test and expecting a new beginning. They could have cheated and got someone pregnant here. Yeah, the police. Sexual protection here. Getting ready to watch the shit go down because the cops are getting ready to make an arrest. This person could have been a runaway that was insecure or they tried to run away from their feelings. This person was insecure and... This love story has this person all destroyed and shattered and broken. This person is fucked up. Out keeping people's secrets, fulfilling their fantasies. Dating history or killer knew a victim. Suspect lives near the scene of the crime. Pregnancy test announcement expression or revealing that there could have been a pregnancy here and they don't want they don't want to hear that they got somebody pregnant and it sent this person out into a freaking crazy rage here Important details are not being revealed to the public at this time. Details leading up to the murder may be worth investigating. Tell me more. We have depression and sex shock and emotional intelligence. So this person is not, they don't want to hear it. They're not emotionally intelligent here. They're all fucked up. And they already know the truth. They don't. They just don't want to hear it. This person's in a state of denial. This person is promiscuous and likes to use toys. I'm seeing a BDSM going on. Could be what was thrown into the trash. Or uh, having someone like, you know, tied up. Something that was thrown away is going to help set the record straight. Killer sustained a wound during the murder. Additional evidence is at the crime scene. And I'm seeing two people besides the victim. I hate nothing about you. They were fulfilling a fantasy 
I feel like more than one person was involved in this. Keeping you a secret. Yeah. Oh, I'll let you do it. I'll let you help. I'll let you help destroy this person's life. I'll let you help fuck this person up. Because they have this toxic, weird-ass love that they've got going on. The killer will murder again. The perpetrator has behavioral patterns of a serial killer. We have expecting a new beginning and it came out reverse and this person's insincere. Or, sorry, insecure. Well, definitely insincere too because that's what I said. When this person gets in their emotions, they do not have emotional intelligence. They run away and they go out and they become very promiscuous. And they end up creating all kinds of messes for themselves. And... We're getting ready to see all this go down because the police are coming in to protect someone sexually. This could be a sexual predator here. And they're pissed because they're not going to get to keep going out screwing around. And they're pissed that they got caught because whatever they're having to do, it's making them stop what they're doing. Yeah, they're being told to use caution here being promiscuous sleeping around sleeps with your man a hot free-for-all and they're all about these toxic private relationships here that they're fucking around with the killer had an argument or disagreement with the victim watching shit go down enjoying the gossip sexual protection and then the cops are on the scene and they're pissed the cops are pissed about this issue here fuck killer may currently be in prison for another crime tell me about this we got no but it came out in reverse so yes there is someone that's in prison already that could be involved in this crime a friend knows something friend knows something we got a grandparent here it's trying to cover something up or like could be you know a parent just you know someone that has grandkids here like your parent if this is your story it's a cult cover up here it's a cult cover up Forensic science field will provide important clues. We've got the government and it has to do with the perversion here. We've got a sexual deviant boner zone. This person's a fucking pervert. Money may be involved. This grandparent here is they're a fucking pervert. They're a sexual predator. Yeah. Money may be involved. It's organized crime here. We've got social media. So it's an organized crime going on here. And there's money involved with this. There's a ritual here. This water supply keeps coming out. I'm telling you something's in the fucking water. Someone got fired. Already interviewed the killer. Crossroads. We've got a crime of passion here telling you that's what I was picking up on this is a crime of passion here some kind of crossroad we've got a rope here god and we've got water here crossing a body of water possibly because if the killer's out of the area then there was some kind of struggle that happened the killer is out of the area it's a secret where this person is this person has a secret space well there's CCTV all over the place so they're being this pervert is being followed and under surveillance by law enforcement huh that's good to know that's good to know because they're definitely under investigating is right under this row here victim engaged in unusual behavior prior to the crime 
they got distraction so this person was distant distracted seemed very disconnected something could tell you could tell that something was wrong with this person they just didn't quite see themselves could be like a missing piece to the puzzle here they were there's a false person here like and the masks are all over this card too so like not acting like themselves hiding hiding how they were feeling or maybe talking about how they felt and they weren't believed is what I'm hearing they were very distracted and occupied in their mind because they they had fear killer worked in the area we got propaganda and a parental figure here so spreading fake news here a parent it's right here with this uh, grandparent here that's what I'm picking up they had a meeting Parents and grandparents meeting up, creating fake news, all coming together. Some kind of fucking war going on between all of, with all of this crime here. Killer profile indicates narcissist or sociopath. And we've got the beach. And strangulation could have happened on the beach. Maybe that's why this person's out of the area and they could have gone to on vacation to the beach or something and a strangulation occurred and the body was left in the water in the ocean. This is the second time that the ocean has come out. Interviews with relatives or friends may provide valuable clues. We have the desert here and I'm just seeing sand. Some kind of ritual here. They could have gone to the desert. But I'm I'm seeing and I was channeling that earlier because look how much sand keeps coming out. And what I was channeling earlier with spirit was that no, it's not what came out before was it's not desert sand, it's beach sand. So that could be some kind of evidence that you know, because different areas have different like you can you can do things to figure out exactly what location is going from testing the soil and all kinds of things so sand could be significant in this for some reason because it keeps coming out it's a female that was strangled due to a ritual here but legal proceedings it's going to the courts Additional evidence at the scene may be discovered. Maybe a relative or a friend lives in the desert. They could live, you know, somewhere that's like a desert type area. Additional evidence at the scene may be discovered. And we have a child. And we've got someone could have been in the military. God. The military could be involved. a burial oh no maybe a, a child's parent is in the military and they have to bury their parent additional evidence at the scene may be discovered hmm about a burial and we've got burning money here for a debt there's a missing piece here some something about there's something missing about this burial here what I've been channeling all morning. What is this spirit? What am I tapped into? Someone coerced the killer into murdering the victim. Someone coerced the killer into murdering the victim. We have traveling with a bioweapon. And we have market manipulation. The fuck? What does that have to do? They traveled in court. They traveled to someone's home. This is a child predator here, I'm telling you. This person was coerced. Outside watching families here. Watching outside watching families traveling. 
coerce someone. Someone coerced the killer into murdering the victim. Saying you need to take this person out. This person is a threat. This person... And I was instantly drawn to secret. That they want this crime of passion to be kept a secret. They don't want this coming out. Because it's an organized crime unit with grandparents and parents here. Yes. And cryptocurrency is involved. Take a closer look at one of the suspects. Clarify this. We have a man-made disaster. And it came out in reverse. This, this was intentional. It's premeditated. War keeps coming. Somebody could be in the military. And could have a, like a child here. That their grandparents getting ready to. Uh, or their parent is getting ready to go down for this because it's some kind of struggle in the water I'm telling you there is a struggle in the water somebody could have faked their death to try to get away and this hands popping up and they're still alive they could have thought the person was dead and they walked away got counterfeit money here they're successful with committing fraud with counterfeit money but now they're sad Someone could be crying because they have this struggle in the water here. They fake their death so that they could get away. This crime may be solved. By DNA testing or other scientific methods, there's a murder-suicide here. Someone could be trying to fake their death. To try and get away. It's this fucking child predator here. <laughs> Trying to cover up the fact that it's a murder and saying that it's a suicide. Trying to say that the child died of natural causes. Get paid a lot of freaking money. Market manipulation with his family here. This fucking corrupt ass family. Witness may not be fully disclosing all of the facts. We have blackmail. Someone could be, this person could be a Republican here that's getting blackmailed. Something about what's underwater. They don't want this coming out. This is like on the bottom of the, of the water here on the floor. Sunk to the bottom. Tied down with something. This rope over here. Jealousy, an affair, or love-related crime. I can clarify this. We have a reptilian here. See, I'm telling you, it's a rope. They strangled somebody, tied them up. Jealousy, an affair, or love-related crime. We've got trees in here. Communication. This person could hang themselves and could have hung someone. Or strangled them with a rope. Strangled them to death. We got the fucking devil here. The secret society. Tying people up. I'm telling you. I just keep seeing someone tied up. We have a caregiver here. This person could work in the medical field. We have a stethoscope here. We've got a witness that saw this person do something. We have intuition here. There's a hair. Could be getting tarot readings or could be a psychic involved. Tap. This is me. I am tapped into this freaking serial killer. I've been tapped into this motherfucker. There's something going on in a wooded area. I'm telling you right now. Could be near like woods near a hotel or a motel somewhere. This person could jump off a freaking bridge and commit suicide. At then they're going to have to clean the, up the road. Like they're going to have to literally clean it up off of the road. I'm trying to clean up that there was a kidnapping here. They don't want. 
Oh dear God, and we have dismemberment. And that could be what's going on with this wooded area here. Scattering, scattering it throughout the woods. What's the contents of that bag? Oh. Dating history or killer new victim. Yeah, we've got bloodline. So your family here, evil corrupt fucking crime family. Dating history or killer new the victim because it's in your in your bloodline. So this is a would be like a blood relative. Walked away. Don't have anything to do with this person. You had to heal yourself from this energy because this is a crazy motherfucker. And you have power from the universe here that is protecting you. And this person's operating out of their fucking ego. This person's affluent. It was flipped over in the deck. So this person's wealthy. This person could be a doctor. Could be a surgeon. This person's got a lot of money. And now they're regretting what the fuck they've done because someone's still alive and they don't like that. I'm seeing this power supply and collapse is like cutting the power to or to someone's house and then tearing their freaking house down. Or trying to, with burning evidence, burn a house down to where evidence won't be found for the crime scene here. This person has mental health issues that came out again because of this breakup. This breakup has got this person fucked up. This person needs to heal. This person is out of control. This could be a spouse or partner here. We have hidden keys to a location here is what I'm hearing. We have a marriage and a wedding here. They could have hidden keys to someone else's house. They could have someone trapped and locked up, hidden in, in a different location. They're out of the area because they've kidnapped someone. They've got someone hidden and trapped. And this is someone's spouse that's doing this. Suspect lives near the scene of the crime. And this is creepy because he's standing off. There's a portal here. There's life insurance policy involved. He's like standing here looking at, through the windows at this house watching. And this someone that's in your bloodline here if this is your energy god i hope it's not but we have a portal here and a life insurance so it could be like an online portal to check balance of money or whatever a payout but we have a death a life insurance someone stole they're scared now. They stole this life insurance policy after a death. And now they're full of fucking fear. This person. We've got drugs and poison. And we have mind control. This person could be a Republican here. Hmm. So whoever this is. They, they live near the scene of the crime. And they did this for... Uh, a life insurance policy here that they took out on someone. They want, they, I was instantly drawn to money. They want this fucking money. They want this money. This caregiver here. A secret society. Whoever the fuck this is. Important details are not being revealed to the public at this time. There's a skeleton key. Family about who about this family here and on this got this right here with this card here with a skeleton key there's hidden keys and skeletons in this family's closet the 
key is getting ready to unlock that door and all of this is getting ready to come out what was hidden is not going to be able to be hidden anymore and whoever they paid to keep quiet this missing piece of the puzzle uh your ancestors and the divine and the council of light has stepped in telling you right now details yeah we've got trafficking here partying on a boat trafficking runaways and we have corruption greed a lot of money details leading up to the murder may be worth investigating about this trafficking here inside tunnels there's a lot of tunnels killer sustained a wound during the murder what about this they got angry oh god we got pizza gate shit that's not good. in the water supply right back again so they're, they're putting something in the water could be like could be like a body in in these big things you know like something thrown down in there wow they're happy about assassination plots here they're happy about assassin about this taking people out and whenever they got mad they got hurt and with this gun here they could have accidentally shot themselves or something in some way or um, some kind of backfire could have happened or angry but this person definitely has a has a gun as a weapon here We've got justice, and we have aliens. Supernatural, divine justice right here. Because of this abuse and neglect, we have lot liar is written across this person's mouth. We've got a female. Could have said that, oh, you're not being abused or neglected in the home, and now this person ends up in this huge freaking mess. In the courts. Additional evidence is at the crime scene. Communication. We've got a, a landfill. Top secret classified communication regarding what was found in a landfill because of the powerful status of whoever this is regarding this homicide here. This person could have gotten fired from their job. Top secret, they don't want anyone to know about what was dumped in the landfill person's in a position of power in the community and they could have gotten fired from their position so now they're on like a freaking killing spree clarify killer will murder again been successful at market manipulation here creating these rituals that are going on so this is a ritualistic killer they're they're very um ritualistic whenever they whenever they do what they do because they want it to be successful he's meticulous he's tidy a watch could be significant brown shoes a blue jacket blue pants boat and water yes there's something on a boat some kind of party that happened on a boat there could be forensic evidence that's there or this person had a boat and uh, 
could have passed out on the boat. Could have said someone got fucked up on a boat and drowned. <clears throat> Saying that it was an accident, you know. Boating accident. It's this freaking cult here. This person did a cult. They took a secret trip on a boat somewhere. This person's gonna go to fucking prison. Perpetrator has behavioral patterns of a serial killer. And we have outside. So, like, they schedule time outside to watch. They're stalking. Looking through the windows here. This person's very premeditated. And they're very ritualistic in how they operate and fulfill these fantasies that they're that they're doing whenever they do this. We've got the mountains. A female and a natural disaster here. That someone they buried a female on the mountains. And a natural disaster here with some kind of tornado or bad weather could end up ruining or ruining the the evidence here for this could be part of why they're having a hard time because of just natural inclement weather going on somebody's buried on the top of a freaking mountain here and the easiest way to get some something that heavy up to the top of a mountain to bury it is to dismember it for sure god this is a fucking crazy reading we have a democrat false person and parental figure here There's an accomplice and, part, and a partner in crime. They're discussing things on social media or something to do with social media. But God is here and God has stepped in and God's getting ready to bring down the boom. The killer had an argument or disagreement with the victim. Watching shit go down, enjoying the gossip. What's this? God almighty, what a fucking mess. home keeps coming out someone that acted like they loved you loving going to people's homes acting all loving so they can get in and that way they can abuse and neglect and saying oh I didn't do anything they're lying I'm I'm not like that I'm not doing anything we've got the justice system here so yeah they did do something oh my god watching but besides schools son of a bitch this is a child predator that's a serial killer on my table right now and I have been tapped into this motherfucker for a long time and it oh I am hoping to God that this son of a bitch is getting ready it's a, it's a bunch of them it's an organized crime unit. It's disgusting. And they're trapping and kidnapping. With freaking pervert here. Keeping them hidden. Making fucking movies of them. Of, of their crimes so that, that we can go back and watch their work is what I'm hearing. That way I can watch my work. This person thinks they're a master at this ritual at how they do this. When they when they play this out. Oh my god. Clear for this life insurance. We've got a king of swords and the hanged man. So that's law enforcement knowing about the sacrifice. There's persons getting ready to be trapped and unhappy with this situation because they're getting ready to be in restraints. We've got the two of wands. New path presents itself. Some kind of tribal could be getting ready to happen. We've got the lover situation. And uh, we've got the five of wands here that's creating a lot of conflict. And we've got the high priestess and the hierophant here. Wow. 
powerful intuition coming through here. A powerful high priestess. Difficulty letting go about running around in this Knight of Cups energy and this lover's energy creating conflict, abuse, and neglect because this person is a sexual deviant pervert who likes to kidnap people. Well, the world is getting ready to fucking know all about this. Communication is coming in that this serial killer is getting ready to be caught. This is a faded event. This is destiny unfolding right here. We've got temperance. We've got an earth angel. We've got the tower coming in. Three is so the devil's heart's getting ready to be broken. Truth is going to be told. And they're going to be in the five of pentacles. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let me see what zodiac signs I've got out here right now. I lost my moldavite. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay, <clears throat> so the King of Swords is Aquarius or Libra, Gem Libra Gemini Aquarius. Let's see. The Hanged Man is Pisces and Aquarius. The Two of Wands is Aries. The Lovers is Gemini. The Five of Wands is Leo. The Hierophant is Taurus. The High Priestess is Taurus and Cancer. The World is Leo, Aquarius, Taurus, and Scorpio. The Eight of Wands is Sagittarius. The Knight of Cups is Pisces. The Four of Pentacles is Capricorn. The Three of Swords is Libra. The Devil is Capricorn. The Tower is Scorpio. Temperance is Sagittarius. The Wheel of Fortune is Sagittarius. Queen of Swords is Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And then the Five of Pentacles is Taurus. And then that's where I stopped was at the Five of Pentacles. All right, guys. So I'm going to get out of this energy because I have been in this for hours. But this had to come out. So this is like not going to be specific to most people's cases this is just kind of what's going on with some kind of crazy serial killer on our planet right now all right guys i love you have it have a good day bye guys